Hey everyone, Brandon here. So today is a different video. It still deals with technology, so this is why I'm un unboxing it. Now, most of you probably don't know, uh, we are expecting our first child, and it is a baby boy, by the way, and we should expect him probably in the next couple weeks or so, if not sooner. So, one thing that every parent needs is going to be a baby monitor, and this is the new Alec Cam 2. We're going to unbox it. I'm going to talk about a couple of the features, and then we're going to see how it does later on. So let's get to it, and I'm going to unbox this bad boy. Now with the Alec 2, it does stream 1080p quality. It has both video and audio, and some cool things about it, it can do a 4x zoom, wide angle, it also has night vision, which is pretty cool, and <laughs> it can do a lot of other things like detect what the temperature and humidity in the room is, and of course, if you want to later on, you could always get the outlet sock too, and they coexist with each other to work together to give you the best baby monitor experience there so this is actually the outlet this is the camera itself very small very sleek and i see one thing i don't like already this is a new version and it's it's got a micro usb port instead of a usb type c which you know i'm very fond of the usb type c ports now i'm assuming on the back we have speakers we have a qr code and we also have a little power button now we do have a mount system here that is magnetic that you can put on either shelving or maybe mount it on your wall and you could have it in lots of different directions just swiveling it on the strong magnet which i think is actually really cool and i think a lot of companies should adopt this type of feature instead of having a mount that goes forward backwards or side to side this way you have 360 degrees of any type of swivel room which is very very cool now and this little box here, which has number three, I don't think I'm supposed to open that yet because number one is right here. And these are going to be a couple more mount brackets that you could use. Now maybe these are more for the wall than this right here. But I feel like you could actually mount that to the wall as well by itself. But, you know, I can always be wrong. And sometimes I am. So, yes, you could mount this to your wall. Snap this big boy on like, like that. And then press down and you'd be good right there. Now, in this box number two, which is marked clearly on the boxes. Now these are actually just cord hiders. Uh, you can put your cords down the middle and hide it against the wall if you need to. Um, I feel like that would be needed in some cases, but in other cases, I'm pretty sure you could hide it enough where A, the baby can't get to it or any pets. Now when we go to box number three, which is right here, we have a charging block, which is right here. And this charging adapter is just, a, looks like just a generic adapter. Uh, doesn't look like it's a fast charger or anything like that, but your baby monitor is gonna be plugged in at all times regardless, so that doesn't really matter. And when it's not in use, well, I guess you just unplug it. Now, in this part right here, we do have the charging cable, and my god, that is a lot of cable there. So you could probably put this pretty much anywhere. And I'm not exactly sure what the pen holes in this part is here. Maybe um, this is for securing purposes on the wall. 
maybe I'm not exactly sure and then of course like I said we have the standard micro USB which I'm very sad that we have that not a USB type C and then of course we have a standard USB port there now that you also get a notification if you use their app of motion, crying, screaming, etc., etc., and that is one thing I do like about technology the, these days. Now, I do see a little microphone right there. You probably can just barely see it in that little glare spot. Um, at the bottom of the camera right there looks like we might also have an infrared sensor up top and then like I said microphone is right there so overall we're gonna have to test this out see how well it does and then of course I will be back with a review video once um, our little boy is here and I see how well this works now I think another purchase I will be getting will be the outlet sock which is really cool as well so anyways guys if you're having a kid or having a newborn or becoming a new parent like me and you're looking for a BB monitor the outlet 2 could be a great possibility for you and I will have a link in the description below if you want to check it out so anyways, if you like this video, please consider liking, subscribing, commenting. I'll see you next time. Take care, and bye-bye for now.